there guys welcome back to all motive activities today we'll be going over driving school locations in real life first of all we got the sydney opera house if i am correct it looks just like this in driving school sim you know we got the sin uh, signature like cave looking things it's not like that in real life but i got a really cool story about it so let's just switch it over this is what it looks like in real life and yeah, it's pretty similar, not the texture. Texture, one looks like sand, one looks like actual really cool engineering. But literally, w one time in a trivia, like it was Jeopardy, we were playing Jeopardy. And this game, Driving School Sim, literally helped us get like 500 points from it. Because I literally remembered this building right here on your screen right now, in Driving School Sim, I remember that was in Sydney and I got the question right and it was a 500 quest, 500 point question in Jeopardy. But yeah, look at the texture on this one. It is pretty similar to um, Driving School Sim, like where my Lambo was. Lambo, Lambo boy. But um, yeah, it was pretty similar, like this little like walking area. And beside it, there's another road. So if I were to rate this, this is like one of the most realistic locations from Driving School Sim into real life but yeah the only difference between real life and driving school sim is a little bit of the proportions between the like people walking area and the um road since the road is like really really small but it's also kind of like a little starting road but now let's move on to washington dc and you know we got the white house if i am correct i actually forget this is the white house but it looks pretty similar because i do remember and yeah, so in real life, it actually looks pretty similar with the stairs and the fountain. There is no fountain there, if I'm correct. But yeah, it looks pretty realistic. And there are like lots of US news, so it looks pretty similar. I'm sorry if that's not the White House uh, viewer for you guys. But now we are on Paris, and this is the Eiffel Tower. This is also one of the most realistic locations in real life. Let's switch over right now. There we go. It's really, really realistic. So this road that leads up to it, there's literally a road from spawn that leads up to the Eiffel Tower. And that is really, 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 really epic because it actually feels like um, the Oblex um, um, developers actually looked at this and modeled it pretty similarly. As you can see, you've got this little area. So this really reminds me of spawn, like the spawning location that like parking lot. And then we got roads that connect to each other. And then we got like a bridge that connects to the Eiffel Tower. This area not really spawn, maybe the other side. But this is like, this actually, sorry about those words. They, it kind of reminds me of like the area after spawn where my Lambo was. Like we got the bridge. And then we got this like green little area, which was like all those like buildings and stuff in driving school sim. We got like a, I forget it was like a... No, that was Rome, but it was like a, like, there's a bunch of buildings after it, and that is really, really close to real life. Now, let's move on to Las Vegas, one of the more unrealistic locations in Dragon School Sim. So, as you can see, it says, welcome to fabulous Las Vegas, Nevada. 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 <laughs> there's some way to say it. Fun fact, we've actually, I, I, we, uh, my, me and my uh, family, we went on a road trip to Las Vegas. And yeah, the location here in Dragon School Sim is not realistic at all. As you can see, this is literally what it is. My parents and I and my sister, we all like lined up right at the sign and took a picture. I literally have it. I don't want to show you it. But yeah, it was a cool place. It was pretty hot there in the winter. But this is not as realistic as Driving School Sim. But yeah, let's move on. Like so, here's a more wider angle. This is more of like a the Las Vegas Strip. And that is not really the Las Vegas Strip, it's more a highway. But this area on the Las Vegas Strip really reminds me of the trailer clips where there's that red CA Corvette and one was called Alex and I forget the other car. But yeah, this area reminds me of those like cool city neon light things in Las Vegas. But sorry, but we just moved all on over to Moscow. Look at this, so this like tower thing, I'm sorry if I don't, I forget, I kind of forget the name. Sorry, it's kind of a hard one to remember. It's a toughie, but this, this is also one of those more realistic looking locations. As you can see, we've got the snowy road that leads up to it in the most magnificent, magnificent way ever. And here's real life. It looks really, really dang similar, honestly, with the colors 
they're vibrant colors and literally google maps is literally on snow so that is like the best thing ever we got snow and yeah so it's like really close in colors and proportions is actually pretty close too look at that crane in the corner though and the little like buildings after it that's just really really cool we got all the buildings the same colors proportions and if we were to like move it in google maps which you can um it's kind of like yeah no this is google maps not apple maps but yeah you can like move it and here's the like what it looks like if you were literally standing on like the deck of the castle and this is actually realistic because on the left you can see there's a road if you really look there's a road and that literally is what moscow is in driving school sim right here on the left and then we got this like blank little area where in driving school sim it's more like snow and then we got a bunch of buildings which is actually really similar to driving school sim too because that's where we kind of like spawn it's just so realistic on the other side we also have buildings just like driving school sim and yeah so this like location is really similar i would actually kind of want to visit this place in real life maybe um a little road trip one day maybe um so don't forget to subscribe for like 10 years from now we'll be doing a road trip there but yeah this place is really really cool and it's really proportionally accurate and like realistically accurate to driving school sim and now let's move over to rome and yeah we got the um the old colosseum if i'm correct i might be wrong about that too but for social studies um in my class we were actually, I, I literally showed my teacher this in the game. I loaded up the game and showed my um, teacher if I could do this. Because this is actually a cool research project. Since we are in the game, this is literally an advantage point in social studies. This game literally has Rome's whole map in the game. So it really does help you for research of the like map and like exterior of the building. I know it's not accurately detailed, but it is pretty close. Look at this. It's really, really, really close. And yeah, it's a really good research thing to have that game while you're on social studies. And yeah, my so some other group literally chose it before us. So we had to do aqueducts in Rome. It was also a cool project. But yeah, like literally driving school sim could really help you when you're doing social studies. Like, because they're actually like, I think Overlex some. I wonder if someone can like make them. Maybe I'll make a more advanced video of how maybe we predict how they make maps and stuff. That would actually be a cool video. But yeah, they actually probably look at like maps and 3D images and they turn that into game footage, but not really as similar. But that'll be it for today's video guys. Don't forget to subscribe. This will be on my Factivity. Sign the video off.